All right, so in this video, I'm gonna solve the equation 25 to the power of 2x is equal to 50. So to solve this, I'm gonna first rewrite 50 as two times 25. And then after that, I'm gonna divide both sides by 25. So this way, because these two have bases of 25, I can simplify this. So I have 25 to the power of 2x over 25 is equal to 2. And now from here, 25 is the same thing as 25 to the power of 1. So if I have something in the form a to the power of m over a to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m minus n. So it's equal to 25 to the power of 2x minus 1 is equal to 2. So now I'm going to take the log on both sides. So I get log. 25 to the power of 2x minus 1 is equal to log 2. And I'm also going to rewrite 25 as 5 squared. So I get 5 squared, or I should say 5 to the power of 2 times x minus 1. Or sorry, 5 to the power of 2 times 2x minus 1 is equal to log of 2. And now... I'm going to distribute the 2 so I get log 5 to the power of 4x minus 2 is equal to log 2. Now I'm going to use the property log a to the power of b is equal to b times log a on this. So I can move 4x minus 2 to this. So I get 4x minus 2 times log 5 is equal to log 2. And now I'm going to divide both sides by log 5. So these two cancel out and I get 4x minus 2 is equal to log 2 over log 5. Now if I add 2, I get 4x is equal to log 2 over log 5 plus 2. And now finally I'm going to divide both sides by 4. But before I do that, I'm going to first find the values of log 2 and log 5. So log 2 is equal to 0 0.3010 and log 5 is equal to 0 0.6989 so I'm going to divide these two and by doing that, I get zero point four three zero six. So I get four x is equal to zero point four three zero six plus two, which is equal to two point four three zero six. So now I'm finally going to divide both sides by four, and I get x is equal to zero point six zero seven six. So this is my answer.